Hey mamas, this is Connie from Milkful with your Milkful tidbit of the week. Today we're going to talk about preparing to breastfeed for the first time. I think the biggest thing with this is education. <clears throat> there are tons of books out there and lots of online resources, and they are great. They can be kind of overwhelming. So I really recommend finding an in-person class. You can usually do this through the local hospital system, birth center, your care providers practice, um, local doula agencies, or just independent childbirth and lactation educators. The class should be at least a couple hours long. It's a great opportunity to ask your questions as they come up, get the fundamentals of how to get off to a good start with breastfeeding, and also connect to other parents who are at the same stage as you. I think they can also be really fun. So um, search around, find what classes are available in your community. I think it's also very important to find local support groups before you have your baby. La Leche League is the biggest provider of support groups, but lots of communities have other groups as well. So ask any parents that have already had their babies um, what support groups they know about, and then also ask your care provider because they usually know what's offered in your community. Most of these groups are very welcoming of pregnant mamas, um, and I encourage you to go to a meeting before you have your baby. It can be really encouraging to see uh, moms who are breastfeeding and how they are tackling the challenges that come up for them. I think it can also be helpful to ask your family members what their breastfeeding experience has been. Um, it can be insightful to know if there are any family history of challenges and then also to know how much or how little support you may have as you get started with breastfeeding yourself. And then um, lastly, if you are anticipating challenges because of family history or previous breast surgery, um, or if you're not noticing breast changes in pregnancy, then I really recommend a prenatal visit with a lactation consultant. They can assess sort of what your situation is, come up with a plan for feeding and checking in, and also um, a plan for support after you have your baby. And then if things are going great, they can tell you that you're doing great. And if you're having challenges, you already have that support in place for tackling those challenges. And then lastly, I think it's really important to go into this with a lot of self-compassion. Breastfeeding is one of those things that we don't know how it's going to go until you try it. And then just with parenting in general, we all make mistakes. There are no perfect parents. And so practicing self-compassion is a crucial part of navigating this parenting journey happily and healthily. So I wanna keep this conversation going and I hope that you will join us over on the Ellie app. We already have some great conversations happening over there. I will start a tidbit topic on this topic specifically. So preparing to breastfeed for the first time. I wanna hear what you did, what you are doing, what worked, what was not helpful um, and what questions that you have about this. So please join us over in Nourishing Baby and Melful Community on the Ellie app. I will leave you with my favorite mantra, your worth as a mother is not measured in ounces. You are enough. Never forget it. Until next time, this is Connie.